So what is up everyone this is Kiran here welcome back to Tech Kiran YouTube channel MIUI 12.5 21.2.4 highest version which is available for the Redmi Note 8 users if you are willing to use MIUI 12.5 right now on your device this might be a very good choice for you this is one of the super fast MIUI 12.5 updates for your device why this so because it's based on Chinese one and this is China's official one this is not Xiaomi EU based this is not MIUI Mix this is not other rooms it doesn't even include the google apps but it doesn't include any kind of chinese bloatware all the chinese apps are removed from this build it's based on the official android version 11 as you can see and it's based on the latest updated beta version if you have unlocked bootloader you have a custom recovery you can install this build on your device and it's better to install this build instead of installing other builds it has all the interesting features you simply need to install google apps separately for that but everything else is super fine this one is actually quite smooth after using some time as you can see there is a very good kind of smoothness there full screen gestures are working just quite great the smoothness is good in the control center also this one is actually good one you simply need to install google apps separately but everything else is good you can see there are no chinese apps unfortunately there are no chinese apps not a single one every chinese app is deleted from here even the xiaomi weather app is not there so this is why i said unfortunately because xiaomi weather app should be there because i sometimes use that but that's not available there but everything else like for example this new volume panel with all those new options updated volume panel basically it's present there it's just working perfectly fine as you can see all these pop-ups silent dnd everything seems to be good and working now as you previously saw the power menu is not changed i don't know why still this redmi note 8 device didn't got the new power menu even though they got the miui 12.5 even though they got android version 11 also but unfortunately no new power menu so this is kind of surprising but we need to be okay with that control center as you already know it comes with this swipe option where you can simply swipe between the notification panel and the control center so it's just up to you we want to use this feature or not or you can simply use the older quick settings options like that and as i previously mentioned to you it is a custom room it's a china beta so the device will not be certified and you will not be able to use the banking apps directly but yes after using some tweaks on your device you might be able to and like this you can see the camera related things it doesn't include any kind of extra specific features same features which you get in almost every MIUI 12.5 update so everything seems to be same nothing else is changed here the main thing about this build is the smoothness and performance and smoothness is good there performance is good there no lags and this is actually good it comes with the latest privacy protection related things as you can see it comes with every kind of new updated apps for example if you move on to the settings and go to wallpaper and personalization the font boldness is a little bit of increased here if you compare it with the xiaomi eu build xiaomi eu has a boldness option present there for you but the thing is that is not that bold this font these fonts are actually quite bold and also this room is why smooth because it even doesn't include any kind of super wallpaper it doesn't even include any kind of still wallpapers like the latest mu 12.5 wallpapers are not present there the wallpapers are actually same so this is actually interesting one you need to keep this thing in your mind if you are looking to install this build on your device everything else is kind of same so if you're looking to install this build on your device you can simply install this and the best part is the room size is also less than 2 gb which seems actually quite good and yes and you simply need to install google apps everything else is done here and extra features i can pack related customizations are present there lock screen display sound and vibration where we have the latest sound assistant as it is android version 11 and everything else is same here home screen it comes with the latest home screen app vault and else etc home screen layout the latest range items in recent option is present here too it also includes every kind of option password and security the new battery menu actually or batteries app is present here also additional settings where you have the same features special features game turbo video toolbox floating windows etc everything else is same and this was all from today's video link for this build alongside with the google apps everything is in the description simply install by installing a zip file and you're good to go goodbye have a nice day
over the edge Feel like I'm floating through the air 